We're back on the Morning Brew with friends with my buddy Andy Lenderman. It's been a minute since I've seen you around. Yes, Things you. going good? We're doing all right. So we just had our, folk, our friends on from the American Lung Association. Yes. They have, it's Albuquerque Firefighters. And Terry, it's Albuquerque Firefighters and Burlington County Firefighters. And they're going head to head, climbing the 500 Marquette Building, mm -hmm. which is kind of the, it's the building right next door to City Hall. Mm -hmm. It's 15 stories. Mm -hmm. Are you going to put money on Burlington County Fire? I'll put money on myself. Are you, are you running it? Sure, I'll do it. Okay, great. I'd be great. happy to jump in. In fact, I know some other people. There's some other uh, current or former amateur athletes um, at the county that could jump in on this. Okay, well, you done, done. Well, Terry's in the, in the studio audience okay. this morning. You, you and Terry can talk. And yeah, and then I, I will actually, I'll see if I can helicopter in and see how, see how winded you are after climbing 15 stories of stairs. You know, I, I commute uh, to work on my bike sometimes and I, I right. take the stairs. It's, That's it's right. really good for you. Right. Well, your office was like on the second floor, so you don't have much to climbing. Uh, not anymore. Actually. No? Yeah, you, we're on the seventh floor. Now. So you're climbing, you're climbing half the distance. Yeah. So you got a week to train. City Hall's what, 12 stories? Uh, 11. 11, so you yeah. can climb all the way up and that'll be, that'll be a good like... You know, primer for Saturday. Definitely. That'd be great. And then also, though, is it this weekend already? Is the South Valley celebration? This weekend, South Valley celebration. Already. Don't miss, don't miss it, Dan. It's because this is this is like is this the longest continuous celebration the county has sponsored? Definitely, it's one. It's among the oldest community fiestas we've we've had established at the county. It started in the mid '90s as a community cleanup, and they had a little fiesta the next day. Uh, 1994, I believe. Wow. So we're, we're well past 20 years now. Yeah. And, uh, so that's like since you and I met each other. It is. <laughs> what were we doing in the 90s? I think we were in college. <laughs> I and remember. Me too, bar barely. But um, the this is like one of those big, it's, it's become such a giant South Valley celebration. And we have, we have some video over here. Ooh, dunk, dunk tanks. Oh, Parades, there's everything at this thing. We're getting good and responses on the parade already, so so that's good. And good. The car club is really fun. Yeah. The the um, one of the things with the parade too is that it goes. It doesn't just go like down a couple of blocks. It goes all the way through the entire South Valley, right? Mm -hmm. And beyond that, oh, there's Commissioner De La Cruz. Looks like he's getting ready with his pickup truck to go out there. There is the community cleanup too, and it's a really, it's really a chance for everybody to come out and kind of walk around and get a feel for the neighborhood and clean up the whole South Valley, right? It's also an opportunity to honor the county's uh, some of the the best volunteer public service we have in Bernalillo County. Uh, every year we do an outstanding citizens celebration where we, we honor the outstanding citizens. Teachers, coaches, police officers, ministers. There's a lot out in the South Valley. Yeah, and it's, it's a really nice way to publicly thank people who contribute to our community. Very cool. Well, the, um, and it's like this all-day thing, too, right? It's not just like a couple hours in the you know, afternoon. I've got something new this year. Oh, what do you have? So Saturday night, we're going to do Monsters, Inc., Movies in the park. Oh, very bring the cool. Kids, bring the family. We're going to have Otter Pops, popcorn, all kinds of fun stuff. Just bring a picnic. So, the first movies in the park of the season, which is an enormously popular program. Right. Well, which park is that that you do that at? Uh, it'll be at Westside Community Center. Oh, okay, great. In the grass. In the grass. And we set up a big, uh, humongous, uh, inflatable movie screen. Mm -hmm. Dusk, uh, I looked it up. So, dusk is 7 52 p.m. Saturday night. When so, sunset. 7 to 7 53, the movie starts? That's right. No, okay, I love it. I love yeah, it. It's, it's a free, it's a free event, great family event, and uh, we encourage people to come and, and check it out. That's cool. Well, Monsters Inc. is a fun movie to start that with too. Um, and is it at the community center? There is that where like, kind of everybody congregates after the parade and after all the all the yeah, events? Yeah, it's, and there's it's vendors standing, out there. It is, yeah. Close to a hundred vendors already. And then mu music all day too, right? Music all day long. I've got uh, local high schools performing. Uh, local middle schools, we've got... Uh, and then professional musicians too, right? Professional musicians, we've got Miguelito Romero, he's enormously popular in the right. South Valley. This right, right. Not just in the South Valley, that guy's big all over. Yeah, it's... <laughs> That's cool. Um, and then, and I know you guys have some sponsors this year that are helping offset the costs, Edward, right? Edward Jones Investments generously donated uh, quite a bit to help offset the cost of this. Very cool. So we're really thankful to our sponsors. Yeah, well, I, this is the kind of thing that it really doesn't happen without that kind of community support. Am I right? That's right. It's it's definitely a successful grassroots event. It's got strong community support. Right. Well, how many people come out for this thing? Because I went. It's I hate to admit I missed it the last couple of years, but I've been, I've been before to the Boy, South Valley celebration because I mean, it's like that whole like neighborhood there. You can't even park. 
Well, the the deputy shut the road down right. for a long time right. to do the parade. I mean, I took my bicycle in a couple of years ago. It was great because you can just ride you can ride down the trail right there, and you can pop right onto a uh, bridge, and you're right there. A couple thousand easy. Like yeah. Big year three, maybe four thousand. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool, and it really is the South Valley celebration. And it, though we talk about it as a South Valley celebration, I think in many ways it's a county celebration too, because this is a way that the county folks re really recognize everybody in the unincorporated areas, right. just on the south side of Albuquerque. And it's right? an opportunity to highlight the services the county provides to the taxpayers. To right. The uh, the fire department makes a great presence at this event, right. at all our community events. The They'll be tired from climbing all those stairs. <laughs> tired. The sheriff arrives and, and some of the interesting, more interesting communities, service-oriented units from the sheriff's department are there, like the bike unit. Um, Very cool. The climbing wall, we've got a climbing wall. Awesome. Yeah, it's, it's something for everybody. That sounds like a plan. Well, don't forget to go on out there on Saturday, this Saturday. The, the, the 30th. The, the movie is on Saturday, and okay. the celebration's on Sunday. That makes it super easy. And then, is it too late to register your car to be in the parade? I don't I, think so. Call Mario Armandares at 505-314-0298 and say, Mario, Andy says. Andy says, I can. I can for the parade. Okay, excellent. Excellent. Thank you. I'll, I'll, I'll put my car in the parade. It'll be fine. Yeah, my hoopty. <laughs> But we'll be back in a couple of seconds on the Morning Brew with friends. Check it out, burnco.gov, and you'll find all the information about the South Valley celebration. And it, is there also a link to all the movies you're going to be showing throughout the summer? That's right. Movies in the Park is live on burnco.gov. Check it out. That sounds good. And then we'll be back in a couple of minutes on the Morning Brew with friends. We have some friends in. They're dressed up like, I think, Shakespearean characters this morning. Should be fun.